What is going on guys? It is Deadshot here to bring you another commentary. This time I'm playing COD 4 because, you know, I have some older gameplays that you guys will enjoy. I go 23 and 9 on this gameplay. Please ignore some of the misses and stupid shots that I went for. Uh, I was kind of bad at sniping when I was playing this. I was going for uh, quad feeds and trick shots for, you know, montages and stuff. But, you know, when I switched to Xbox, I kind of stopped pursuing all that because, you know, I wanted to go full balls deep into competitive. But that is what this video is about. It's about competitive. Um, as you know, the Rise Force team has pretty much found our four players. Um, Taken hasn't really told us yet if he wants to remain on the squad and play with us, or if he wants to continue um, pursuing his own team's um, team's future. You know, he he hasn't really um, told us yet, but. You know, it's he's been practicing a lot with us, so he's he's like a part of the team right now. So I I'm gonna include him in this as well. So pretty much what I could say is, uh, after watching them scrim, they look like a very very strong team. They're just unorganized and they're still trying to figure things out as a team. But one thing that I do like about them is the fact that they have all worked together and discovered, you know, what positions they're better at. So they all adapt to each other and change their positions according to, you know, who's better at what. You know, now Cablet and Owls are the two SMG players and Taken and Rogue are taking up the, the, uh, the AR spots. So, you know, they've really started to figure out how things are going to work out for the team. They've been scrimming a lot, you know, they've been, they've scrimmed probably like five or six teams yesterday in just a couple hours, so no, they're doing very, very well. Uh, they didn't really lose yesterday that I know of. They lost, um, a Blitz, I think, and they lost a Dom, and they lost a Search. But other than those three games, I think they were, like, for the day, like, 16-3. and three. Like, They were doing very, very well, and the teams they were playing were pretty decent teams, so... You know, they're all no names. But, you know, they were pretty they were pretty solid teams they were playing. Except for the last one. The last game, they just, just destroyed them. Oh my god, it was like watching a pub match. But yeah, they they were uh, they were starting to get their stuff together yesterday. And that's what's uh, really making this team look so promising. Is they really are... Uh, they're, they're figuring stuff out. They're getting a little bit more organized. They're playing a little bit stronger. Much stronger than they were the first day. And they were playing strong the first day. But the thing that was interesting is, like, the, the team that they lost the Dom to was, you know, Dom has been, like, their best game mode since the beginning of the team. So, them losing the Dom, and then they won the Blitz. Which, we're all just like, what? You know, how, why is this what's going on right now? So, you know, they they won the Blitz. They won the Blitz and lost the Dom. Uh, they discovered they need to figure things out a little bit more with Dom. The only problem I have to say with the team right now is they get a little bit distracted too much with their deaths. And they're still kind of just running around. You know, they they haven't quite gotten to that play, you know, making plays kind of uh, team style. They're just still kind of running around a little bit. But that's, you know, it's like I said, it's a brand new team. They've only just recently started practicing hard and really trying to, you know, develop as a team. So, you know, stuff like that's expected. I'm not really surprised that it, um, that those kind of mishaps are happening. That kind of play style is, you know, occurring right now. So I'm not going to, you know, give them any, you know, bad tongue about it because, you know, it's what happens. They're still they're still trying to figure things out. So, you know, it's just a working progress. I think they look really strong as a manager. Um, and I guess I'm filling in as coach right now because that's pretty much what I've been doing is just watching them play and then uh, telling them what they need to fix. But, you know, me taking up that position, uh, you know, we've been developing because now they have an outsider watching them play. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this little commentary, a little update on how the team is doing. This is, uh, this is it for the video. Hope you guys like all the future videos. And as I do on my channel, this is Deadshot backing out saying peace. See you in the future.